that house. I don't know where they're going to do on the right side. I don't even know what they're going to do across the street. But Joshua says, for me and my house. Their 
church, but that's one altar, but the other altar lifts up the name of Jesus. At the name of Jesus, every knee should bow. At the name of Jesus, every tongue should confess. At the name of Jesus, everybody needs to cry out that Jesus is the Son of God. Yeah, there is a distance between the two altars. Then not only that, there's a difference. There's a difference between the two altars. One altar uh, is a wayward altar. Uh, the road to hell is a wide road, paved road. Plenty of travelers that travel on that road. But the road to heaven is a narrow road, a rough and rocky road. And you see a traveler every now and then. One is a wayward world, and the other one is a willingness, willingness road. Folk got to be willing to serve the Lord. I need to remind you, God ain't going to make you do nothing. He'll set it there. Explain to you the difference. Let you know what's right. Let you know what's wrong. Encourage you to do what's right. But the bottom line is, you must make the decision. The choice is yours. I set before you heaven and hell. I set before you right and wrong. But you got to make the decision. One thing about God, God gave us free will. Yeah, he said, I'm not at the door. But you got to open the door. And not only do you have to open the door, you got to let me in. I ain't going to run in, I ain't going to rush in, I ain't going to push my way in. I'm going to knock. And you got to let me in. But I tell you what happened. If you let me in, I will come in. I'll sup with you. I'll sit with you. I'll meditate with you. I'll be with you. I'll be with you. I'll bless you. You got to let me in. Yeah, yeah. One lift Jesus. One is waiting. One is from for willingness. Yeah, I got an issue. I got an issue. Tell folks all the time I have an issue. I got an issue. We got to beg folks to do stuff in church. Can I go there with you? I got an issue. We got to beg folks to sign. I got an issue. We got to beg folks to pray. All your prayer might not be like somebody else's prayer, but just pray. The Spirit of God receives it, interprets it, and delivers it to God. I got a problem, got a problem, got a problem. We got the bad folks to give and all that kind of stuff. And he said, ah, God loves a cheerful giver. Yeah, yeah, the rubber altar is one of willingness. Yeah, yeah. Then not only that, thirdly, there's a destiny attached to both altars. One altar is heaven. Heaven is real. Heaven is created. For the saints of God. Jesus said, I'm going away. Prepare a place for you. I'm going to come back. Receive you unto myself. Where I am. There you may be also. But don't fool yourself. Hell is real too. There is a hell. Hell is real. Hell is a prepared place for unprepared folks. Hell is for eternity. Oh, we love to talk about heaven and all the golden street and all the pearly gates and all that, but hell is filled with fire and brimstone. And it will burn you for eternity. Just like heaven is eternal, hell is eternal. Between the altar, between the hall altars. Yeah. Halting, unstable between the altars. Uh, cussing and moving and going on and running around between the altar. Be careful. Let me tell you something. Be careful when you come off Mount Carmel. Huh? Be 
careful when you come off Mount Carmel. Y'all know, y'all know the story about Elijah. Say Elijah and outrun the chariot. Say Elijah. You know, Jezebel got hot with him. Wrote him a dirty letter and said, I'm gonna find you. Hunt you down. Have me killed. Say Elijah. Met out on my car. Down to just him. Baal had over 350 prophets. And Elijah said, in the vernacular that my mama would use, enough is enough. Yeah. Enough is enough. Yeah. You need to decide this day yes. whom you going to serve if God is God. Serve him. But if Baal is God, serve him. Y'all know the story. Y'all know the story. God can tell you Elijah said, I tell you what, Elijah said, I tell you what, let's test this thing out. Let's test this thing out. Yeah, if God is God, if, if your God, Baal, is really God, call on him. The God that answers my fire. Let him be God. Hallelujah. Elijah was gracious and let Baal's prophets call first. They say he called, they call all morning long. Call, 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 and call, and call. Yeah. And nobody answered. Nobody. Yeah, cut up on the Nobody answered. Nobody. Say, Elijah like said, call a little louder. Maybe he's outside somewhere. Maybe the phone was off the hook. Call a little longer. Call and call and call and call and nobody else. Right. Finally, Elijah like said, tell you what, hang up now. On, it's my turn. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Elijah like went in his private, private mode and slug. You never have faith on me. But I need you to answer me. I need you to come see about me. I don't know how many of you old enough to remember the saints of old when they get out on their knees and they say, Lord, I need you to come see about me. Yeah, you bow for hell, but if you don't do that, I 
but don't do that. You are right, but the Bible says all unrighteousness is sin. In other words, sin is sin. I heard somebody say one day, mm, mm, have mercy. I heard someone say one day, yeah, I said, <laughs> huh. say, well, Lord, I'm so glad I don't do this now. I don't do that. I don't do this and I don't do that. And the fellow standing beside him said, Lord, have mercy on me. Yeah, I'm a sinner. I'm a rank sinner. Have mercy on me. Sometimes we need to find out that what we really uh, thought we did have, we had. Sometimes we need to find out that we ain't holy, but we sick. 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 Hallelujah. Jesus said, out of the mountain, he said, Lord, if it's possible, take this cup away from me. But in his divine, for some took over and said, Lord, not my will, but thy will be done. At the altar, we need to work. At the altar, we need to worship with the Lord. Tell where Jesus is. Oh, that 
blood. Ha, that's the reason ha, the songwriter said, hey, can you see the blood? Ha, if I know it ha, was the blood for me. Ha, his blood came streaming down. They arrested him. They tried him. They owned him on the cross. He died on Calvary. He died on Calvary. Let me give you a, a few instances. He died to the S-U-N refused to shine. He died to the moon hemorrhage the blood. He died to the stars turned around in their silver socket. He died to the gut so dark you can feel it with your hands. Somebody, an old script writer, wrote it down. Say he died to somebody cry. Friday. I ain't gonna argue with you about 
Sunday morning, whether that was it or not. Ain't gonna argue about whether he should have been buried Thursday, not Friday. But I do know he was buried. And I do know he got up. That's all that concerns me. And I ain't gonna worry. And I ain't gonna argue about no Easter egg or none of that kind of stuff. Just the fact that he got up.
in your mouth. Hallelujah! 